varlet! Don't you dare attach that foot to my ankle! This is Cadwell's longest episode yet. Perhaps I can... That's it! Time to give you knaves what for! These are visions. This member body... Who's there? Speak up! I'm about to teach these rapscallions a valuable lesson. And yes... Ah, jolly good. I could use a noble squire for the battle ahead to battle Ahem. Anyway, uh, Zumok Fu has gathered the dismembered parts of the betrayer's body. I can't allow the necromancer to put him, me, back together. I'm not entirely certain it's definitely a dark, menacing cavern. Just the sort of place necromancers enjoy hanging around. Oh, I'm off to put a stop to these dastardly villains. Guys, can you determine what... Of all the foolish, idiotic, misguided things that Cadwell has ever done, this may be the worst of them all. I'm no expert on necromancy, but it's obvious that our Cadwell is the last piece Zumog Foom needs to restore the Betrayer. Does a soul shriven have a soul? I have no idea how the philosophy of oblivion accounts for such things, but there must be some kernel of the original Cadwell inside the one we know. I managed to scry Cadwell's portal before it winked out. It connected to an ancient crypt in the scar, not far from the stitches. You seek an extent. Thank <laughs> you. 
Travel never used to take this much out of me. Oh well. The adept and the prefect volunteered to scout ahead. They have Something has prevented them from returning. I can only assume the necromancers or their undead have done them in. Don't be a fool. I'm afraid I bungled this one royally, old friend. I opened a portal, meant to put the villainous Sumog Foon to the sword. He, the big cat and the Imperial. They arrived shortly after I did, but they didn't fare much better, I'm not sure. Charge me up again? Capital idea, and I agree. on your hands. Find the rest of me and put it back. You were never strong enough, Zamarak. I died because you were weak. Praying to the moons will save you. Just more fuel for the ritual. Zamarak failed. Again. Zamarak always fails the ones who count on him the most. Careful, Walker. You do not know the burden that Zamarak carries. How dare you say... No. No, you are right to chide Zamarak. Those soldiers, other than torturing me, Boom's fallen. old fool half-brother how could you be so reckless the dragons are your fault yes, I will destroy you at the Damn 
Zumok Fum is stronger than I anticipated. Believe me, it wasn't my intent when I opened the portal. I really have no idea. Five claw. This one doesn't have much time. Nalado should not be here. This one should be prowling the sand behind the stars and preparing for the next pounce. Zumog Fum called Nalado back. He planned to use her in a foul ritual. But dead or no, Nalado is still a soldier. He's... Nalado thought the cloud of energy reminded her of the strange knight adorned in cookware. Return it, perhaps, though that will certainly shred this spirit form. No matter, Nalado no longer belongs in this realm. Tell Queen Carmira and Garashri that Nalado says farewell. Reanimation was complete. Now that I'm whole, I have a destiny to fulfill. So, cheerio! I always heard that introspection could be difficult. <laughs> Meeting yourself. Uh, no one likes to discover that they were a tallow catch. Try I don't think the world can handle. More than one Cadwell at a time. I finished what he, what I started a long, long time ago. I, I remember how we stopped the dragons. Quinzari and I, we tricked Carl Gronti, used his own ambition against him, convinced him. Carl Gronti ordered his brothers to follow suit. Once weakened, we were able to trap them in the halls of Colossus. Then the betrayer, uh, then I, I killed Kunzari. I earned that name. I, I'm still here. Kamira. She looks like an Equida. So pretty. An Equida possessed a key to a special place. That's where I learned to use portal. Luckily, 
They cut off my head and dismembered me before I could reach Joe's core. I guess you have to chop the him up again. Tell Kamira she has the key and look after the little honor of the priest. a moon priest. Could that be the key to using the dragon horn? The same notion occurred to me, Queen Kamira. Wait. Here comes Tarn and the others. Five Claw, talk to me. I am happy to see you and the others, Five Claw, and I'm eager to hear what happened. Wait. Where is Cadwell? Hrm. That does not bode well. The betrayer of Kunzari was a great hero who became a terrible villain. It took all the remaining champions and the moon priests of Anequina to stop him. A special place? That does not give us a lot of information to go on, Five Claw. The ancient legends. I have been studying them. They mention Jode's core, a vault of some kind. Kunzari tricked the demons into storing their power there, though now we know that the demons were dragons. Everyone, meet in the royal study. I have something to show you. Cadwell spoke of Anequina, one of Kunzari's champions. He mentioned a key. I think he meant my pendant. Zamarak remembers. Your mother wore it before you. Does it have more than sentimental significance? It hides me from magical detection. Mother would take my pendant in her hand and whisper, When Kunzari smiled, Aniquina asked the moons to move for him. The Shadow Dance Temple ruins? Is that where the betrayer has gone? I discovered as a young girl that the pendant and this ancient map interact in interesting ways. I learned the stories of Kunzari from my mother. Did I tell you she was a moon singer before she married my father? She said the pendant once belonged to an equina. I am related to an equina, an ancient ruin. The place was once the Shadow Dance Temple, but now it is nothing but tumbled stones. Yes, from Kunzari's story. He tricked the demons into giving him their power. Then, Anequina moved the moon so he could store the power in Jode's core for safekeeping. In their weakened state, Kunzari was able to trick the dragons and trap them in the halls of Colossus. But one of his companions betrayed him, stabbed him in the back and went to the place of the Dark Dance to steal the demon power. I think you are right, Five Claw. The betrayer must want to finish what he started in the ancient time. But the dragons also want that power. Are they working together? As we saw on the map, the root. To send your sickness irregular for a
face the wastes alone, child. This one insists you stay.